guys hello hello it's been a few days if you haven't had the opportunity to check out my recent collaboration with canela serco uh, tammy anderson erica hughes and mina Villegas, please check the end of this video and there'll be a video link there we did a wonderful collaboration called the great S switcheroo and uh we really changed things up for each other and challenged each other's um, ability to do other techniques. And it was really, really great. There was an amazing show of support the day that we aired it on Saturday. Um, so if you haven't checked it out, definitely check it out. In the meantime, I've got leftover paints galore. Um, and I figured I would do a floating cup. I'm going to try for a full black base but if I can't do it I do have some pearl white here mixed up and ready to go and um, I have color shift aqua fluorescent violet by Blick acrylic uh, this is a indigo blue I've got a I think it's a hooker's green I'm not quite sure it could be a Prussian's green a little bit darker a metallic sapphire 24k gold by deco art and then I also have some well-loved and well-used golden's iridescent gold fine in high flow so we'll see um, what comes of this I don't think I have enough black um, for a base so we will Sort of start like this. Maybe we'll do a partial black, partial white. We'll figure it out. And I have more of the white mixed up on the counter over here. I have my dishwasher running too, so I'm very sorry if you can hear that in the background, um, but it is what it is. <laughs> you gotta work full time, you gotta come home and do the regular chores also after dinner. All right, so I'm just mixing up. It's been a while since I stirred this. Uh, this is the rest of the pearl white. We'll leave some to the side to add to the open cup pour. So if you're new to my channel, welcome. Um, this isn't what I normally do, but I love to test the waters a bit. All right. Well, I guess that was supposed to happen, so. Now here, we are going to start right there, although I sort of like that paint splotch. <clears throat> and with a floating cup, you sort of want to seal the edges with the paint. And I'm gonna seal this side with some of the blue that I have going on here, because I'm out of the black. And with one finger, hold it in place. <clears throat> I seem to be pushing it along its way.
I think I'm gonna top it off with just a smidge of gold because I love what I'm seeing right now and some of the pearl white which is completely making some of these cells in here I love this. pearl white in there. Let's push it right back where I want it to go. I don't want it going that way. I love this. So this area right here We're just gonna end it like that. It wasn't coming out as pretty as this, but we are going to torch all in here. And we are going to start stretching in just a moment. But I need to wrap my sweater around me a little more and get the kitchen towel out of the way because this could end not so well. <laughs> And I'm okay with that going off the side. Totally okay with that because I'm not sure if you guys can see, but it does sort of look like a bird. are like the feathers coming off of it. We'll see what it turns into. We're going to play a little more with this. 
I just love the colors in here. And I want to get my tweezers, put them somewhere. So I won't lose them. And I've lost them. I, put, I just had them too. <laughs> All right, guys, so uh, obviously my lights are glaring off of this, but I thought this was pretty cool. Sort of like a cobra, could be a bird with a, I don't know, maybe a uh, worm in his mouth. Could be an eagle on a rock. Maybe we draw some to the feet down here and uh, go from there. Um, but I think it turned out really cool, minus the glare of the light, but all right. Well, thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you have a fabulous evening. Thank you so much for watching. This is just a little bit of fun with some leftover paint. I'll get back to my normal pouring in the next day or so. Bye for now.